Were you, were you kind of happy or sad that they killed her off? Because that's it, there's no going back, is there? Yeah, I was a bit unsure at first as to what I wanted to happen to the character, but then now I'm happy that she's been killed off because I'm not forever looking over my shoulder, you know, wondering whether I've got the option to go back. It's kind of spurred me on to do other things and work harder, I suppose, to... Mm. You know, to do well. Well, 14 years you were in Emmerdale. It's yeah. long. It's hard to leave yeah. something after that long. It is. It was. It was a big decision for me. It was going against all my instincts because mm. I love everybody there. It's like, like my family. Um, I had great storylines. It was going into work and working with my best friends every day. Yeah. And I loved it. And there was it. a terrible possibility that you may never cry again in real life. Because <laughs> <I mean, laughs> no, obviously you spent out. most of your time, as we saw from those clips there, weeping and yes. wailing like yeah. a banshee. Yes, pretty yes. much every other scene. Oh. Are you really good oh, at that? Do you turn on the tears? Or do you oh, have I'm to... an expert crier. <laughs> yeah, I've had to be. I've had to be. How, how can you do that? How, how does that work? Um, it depends. Sometimes it's, it can be a bit fake, <laughs> but other times you just think of something really awful. Um, something, yeah, I don't know, someone dying, yeah, yes, something yeah, like yeah, that, yeah, you something know. Personal, you yeah, just, yeah, or something that's happened to me in the me. past. Music. music helps, but yeah. it's hard to have music on set, you know. Yeah, that's true. Can you just play that track for me, please? Yeah. I'll start getting into the mood. Mm. Yeah, 